Here we have a winding river with complex forest on both banks. In this demonstration, we're going to use our stream table to show how mature riparian forests are essential for reducing erosional processes in a watershed. The roots of these mature trees work to hold these soils together. Before the Forest Practices Code was introduced in the 90s, many riparian areas were clear-cut logged. With all these trees removed, their root systems die and no longer hold soils together as they once did. Instead of a winding, curving river, the river begins to straighten out and run faster, taking more and more sediment with it. If you look here in the forested area, you can see minimal erosion and a deep channel. But the unvegetated lower channel looks very different. Erosion is happening quickly and aggressively, resulting in an overly dynamic river that migrates back and forth as it erodes the banks. The river is getting wider and shallower and is oversimplified. There is no viable habitat for salmon to thrive in. Complex old growth forests beside rivers are essential to hold the river together. The loss of streamside old growth has resulted in an unraveling of many rivers on the west coast. This results in poor habitat for salmon.